YouTube salute. I'm here with Monday mail day number 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Damn, this is the 10th Monday mail day. So I'm back again. I appreciate everybody, all the love and support. Everybody's been checking out the new interviews with John Connor, Beat Out the God in the interview playlist. More interviews to come. Everybody been looking at all the content, you know, giving me feedback, you know, liking the videos, you know, thumbs up in the videos. It's all love with love. So let's start with the first question. Uh, first question is from Wupak. He said, best MF Doom character out of Doom, King Gil Dorham, and Victor Vaughn. Um, probably Victor Vaughn is the one to me, you know, I mean, uh, Doom is cool, you know what I'm saying? He's a cool MC, but I don't listen to him all like that, but I've heard the different characters, but I think the Vic, the Victor Vaughn character probably stands the most out as far as his alter ego. But, you know, everybody's different. Who they going to like? All right, next question. Lucky, what's your opinion about the group Run the Jewels and their skill, skill set? Um, the skill set is tight. I love Killer Mike. LP is, is dope. Um, Run the Jewels, they, they latest album is a nice album. I listen to it, you know. Um, I always love their stance, everything they do. I mean, <laughs> they're, they're, they're good for hip hop. They're not, I'm not gonna say that, you know, they're good for hip hop. Dope skills, you know, I love the messages they have in their, uh, in their albums. And, you know, so I'm very thankful just to have groups like Run the Jewels that, you know, give Hip hop, a, a fresh, um, a fresher breath air, cause you know that you don't have to hear that same rundown bullshit. All right, next question is from Lucky. Did you read the news about Dave East regarding beat selection and having the same issue in the department with Nas? If you did, what's your point of view regarding that issue? I heard that bullshit. Dave East is his own man. He's not Nas 2.0 when it comes to production. I actually like Dave East, um, the beats he select. So I don't know what the fuck people are talking about. People are so stupid. People want to hear what they want to hear. To me, it's like, let the man choose what he want to choose. And if that's how he want to, you know, beats he want to rap on. Because see, people hear certain beats, oh, so-and-so should be on that beat. Not necessarily. Because I've heard people sound, um, get on other people's um, beats, like a freestyle. It sounds tight, but that's a freestyle. Make a whole song. That's the thing. Can you make a whole song and make it tight? Everybody can't do that. And Nas always had tight beats to me. For real. And I care more about the the, the message, the lyrics, than the beat. The beat is good. Don't get me wrong. But if the beat overshadows the lyrics, then what? So, but thank you for the um, question, Lucky. Last question is from Wupak. Who won the beef between Eminem and Cannabis, in your opinion? Cannabis by far. Eminem don't be beating up. The motherfuckers people say Eminem be beating is like Ja Rule and people like that. Eminem don't be beating nobody. He didn't beat K Reno. Cannabis destroyed Eminem. He was just blackballed. But Eminem didn't want to battle Royce to 5 9. You saw that shit. There's a lot of Eminem groupies out here, for real. Motherfuckers be trolling, they at, trolling him and shit. To me, it's nothing wrong having your favorite MC who you love and you want to root for. Ain't nobody tripping off that. But all these motherfuckers just jump on certain people's dicks, whatever. To me, like I said, I never knew even cannabis won the beef like that until I had to actually go back and analyze every disc record they had. Like, damn, okay, cannabis got him. Yeah, but to me, it's like they're gonna they're gonna just say Eminem won all because of Eminem has more money. He sold more records than cannabis. That's why they're gonna say that shit. That's like saying. Jay Z lost to uh, Benny Siegel when Benny Siegel was um when that time he had made a diss. They're not gonna say Benny Siegel beat Jay Z. They gonna say oh fuck Benny Siegel. Jay Z got more money. So it's always like that when it comes to dumb shit. When it comes to beef, people don't really want to break down and analyze and be honest about a beef. So cannabis one to me. 
Those are all the questions for Monday Mail Day number 10. Thank you, everybody, for the love and support. Like I said, if you want to submit questions every time for Monday Mail Day, please check the community tab on my homepage. Usually Thursday, Friday, or Saturday, I put up a, a post saying submit your questions below. And it's usually a photo of a mailbox. So just drop your questions right then and there. If you feel uncomfortable dropping your questions right there, you can always email me your questions. My email is in every video in the description and only two questions max per week. All right. So until next time, everybody, you already know.